This is officially Christmas Eve 2016. Just had a big conference because we've had to make changes with immediate effect to the Christmas plan because um, he's still got the lurgy. Um, so we're no longer going to Suffolk for the biggest Christmas lunch ever. 36 Christmas puddings I had. Um, we're now going to David's mother. Uh, my parents are coming around today. Um, so we'll be staying around here over Christmas. I'll post my address at the end of the vlog and if anyone wants to pop in and see us, um, donations of wine, beer and champagne will be greatly appreciated. What, what other drinks would you like? Yeah, again, it's not a mirror. Ugh. Oh, you're making the camera ill. So what we're facing here is a really big situation where supermarkets will close for one whole day and people could actually starve to death. So what you need to do is stock up on everything today because once again shops will close at 4 and be closed for a whole day tomorrow. Making a very important last minute trip to Argus because we decided that three Amazon Echoes isn't enough. Uh, Amazon have no more stock and I've got a £10 voucher that expires today for Argus so going to go and pick that up now and uh, we've realised we've forgotten some things so we've gone into another supermarket. This dog always stares. Are you feeling all festive? Um, yes I'm feeling a bit better thank you. Well you're a bit blurry. <laughs> Might be the camera though. <laughs> What are you looking forward to most about Christmas? Uh, spending it with my friends and family. Yes. Luckily they're all busy this year. <laughs> which one are we getting? Well, which one? Which one are you getting? That one there? With what the beard that's sticking out. What, him? The, him. the one on the platform. Well, he's, he's got authority. Should we go now? One echo collected, echo number four. This will go in the kitchen. So this is Operation Christmas Eve lunch with my parents. Having salmon. Slightly uh, left field, I know, but yeah, there we go. So bruschetta to start and salmon for the main course. <laughs> just before 7am on Christmas Day, 25th December, and I'm now off for my obligatory Christmas Day run. So I'm back from my run. I wouldn't say it was the um, best or longest Christmas Day run. In fact, it was just under five miles, 4.71 to be precise. Been awake since four o'clock for some unknown reason. I can only think it's the excitement of Christmas because I'm so excited. Uh, as is traditional, we're cooking vegetables at 7.30 in the morning. How are your vegetables? Good, thank you. What are you cooking? Vegetables. Vegetables and bacon. A nice kosher breakfast. As a penance to my sarcasm yesterday about shops being shut um, and everyone rushing out to buy stuff that they uh, really don't need, we've run out of eggs. And I, I, I reckon our trusty BP garage will be open. Actually, it's not really a BP garage. It's got an M&S in it. It's, it's a mini mart. Mini mart. Huh? Um, scale down supermarket fits inside a petrol station. <laughs> Sells pies, antifreeze. Yep, it's got one of those. Those poor guys having to work today. 
But they have got Christmas songs, and I'm sure they'll all be going home to a very nice roast later on. Welcome, welcome, Merry Christmas! I'm not being funny. Seeing by this fire sends you into an early menopause. <laughs> A friend gave us the wood for the fire. I'm not gonna say who it is. Edward. Um, however, the wood went straight out, so we're now just burning kindling, which is just like burning reams of paper. Yeah. Um, we're hot now, in 10 minutes we'll probably be freezing cold, so yeah. we'll probably open the front door to warm the house up. It's minus two outside. <laughs> What's been your highlight of Christmas Day so far? Um, well, I love seeing my mum. Yeah, and my brother, very nice, very my brother's good. partner. Yeah, seeing my dad, his partner, and all of my sisters, and my brother, and all of their family. Yes. And it, we ended up being drunk. The kids, shut up. The kids part of the table. Yeah, we did. Which I quite liked, actually. Yeah, kids don't normally like us. No. Yeah, cat people. Cat people. Yeah, they, oh, yeah. uh, it was also nice seeing my parents on Christmas Eve. It was very lovely seeing David's parents. Very lovely seeing, seeing my parents. We had a Eve. lovely meal and yeah. we had some band Yes. And we had some Cards Against Humanity. Cards Against Humanity. Humanity with my mother. David's mother, she yeah. played the best cards. Yeah. She did. Yeah. Something about ginger people. <laughs> I sold my drone uh, because of the bailiffs. No, I sold my drone because DJI released the Mavic Pro. However, what they didn't say when I ordered it on October 15th was that they can only produce 200 a day in the factory in China. Demand was far greater than they ever expected. And going by DJI's website, they're now saying delivery for March, which is too long. So I'm getting desperate and I'm looking on eBay. So if anyone has, a DJI Mavic Pro to sell. I'm not fussy, but I would like the fly more combo. You've got my contact details. I'll just comment in the box below. What are you looking forward to most in 2017? Uh, Australia. Australia. In We're March. going to Australia in March. Uh, Seattle, San Francisco, LA in August, September. Yes. Yep. Um, New York in November. Maybe. Um, yeah. Do you like the new artwork? Yeah. Do it's you? the Justin Bieber cow. Woof.